Hi, welcome to Blender. The first thing you want to do if you're going to use Blender on a Mac is you want to change a couple of user preferences. So what you need to do is go up to File and then select User Preferences. From User Preferences you want to go to Input. And under Input you want to tick Emulate 3 Mouse Button and Emulate NumPad. These will help you with your navigation in the program. You then need to save these user settings, and this way these settings will always be the same every time you open. So make sure you click Save User Settings, and then you can click the red dot to make that box go away. Now, because you have um, chosen to emulate the numpad, when you press the numbers across the top of your Mac keyboard, you can change your perspective and you can always see what the perspective is um, in the top left. You'll see, for example, that now we are looking down at the scene from the top and a really fun one is zero. Zero gives you the camera perspective. So this will always show you what your camera can see. Uh, going back to one. So the other thing that's happened now is because you're emulating the um, three button mouse, when you um, move two fingers on your trackpad, you'll be able to just um, change the angle of your view. And you can actually do full circles by spinning around if you like. Um, and that's just two fingers just sliding gently around on your trackpad. If you press shift, you will be able to and move two fingers on your trackpad. You can move your view up, down, right, and left. So this can be really handy when you're trying to look at a certain part of your scene. The other thing you'll need to do is you'll need to press control and slide two fingers on your numpad. This lets you zoom in and zoom out. So again, two fingers on the um, trackpad just rotates your view. Shift and the trackpad slides your view up, down, right, and left. And control and numpad zooms your view in and out. And there you go, control with Blender.